In the last few months, we've had a, quite a few Rolls-Royce Corniche uh, wood trim sets sent to us for refinishing, restoration, repair. And maybe because it's spring, uh, people want their convertibles looking good. This is part of the wood out of a set from Florida. And a couple of things uh, make it noteworthy. It's, uh, as I say, this is a Rolls-Royce Corniche. We showed, I think, uh, earlier a Bentley Continental of the 80s era, which is basically the same, same wood, but with a Bentley named plate. This is the instrument, fa or the instrument fascia, and this is where the steering wheel would be, the driver sitting here. These are all the gauges that would come over here to the glove box, and a couple of other finishers would complete the dash. This is factory original woodwork, and we refinished it, did a little bit of repair on it. This is the driver's side door, and in a convertible or a coupe, drop head coupe, this is gonna be a long door. The rear seat, this is the rear quarter cap for the passenger in the rear, rear seat. So there'll be two doors, two rear quarter caps. This is only a partial set that we have here right now, but the ones that we kind of wanted to show um, instead of an entire set. What this car would have, or a typical Rolls-Royce Corniche or a Bentley Continental would have, would be four pieces in the dash, a couple of console pieces, two doors, two rear quarter caps, two ashtrays, uh, covers in the back, and six pieces of solid wood in the convertible top. This car, though, has a fairly unusual uh, set of picnic tables. Uh, Corniche came, or maybe they were special ordered, I'm not sure, with picnic tables. Uh, remember, this is a small rear seat, and this is a convertible. So you've got a long door, short rear quarter caps, and not much space in the back. For the counterpart, the four-door counterpart of the same era would be the Silver Spur or Spirit, the Spur being a long wheelbase. So they put picnic tables in the long wheelbase, and the Spur was about four inches longer rear door than the Spirit. That gave the extra room for the passenger in the back to pull down the table and use it for whatever they want to use it for. So it's a little bit of an anomaly to have picnic tables in the back of a, of a convertible. How they distinguish themselves, or how the Corniche uh, picnic tables distinguish themselves from the spurs, again, of the same year, or approximately the same decade, is that these are mounted on the back of the seat, so that the back of the seat would come here, and the frame is exposed and finished. On the spur, and almost any other Rolls or Bentley picnic table, you're going to have the table, or the the uh, picnic table flush with the back of the seat and the frame inserted into the seat. So the edge sides would not be visible. They'd be finished off with some leather. So that makes it a little different. It is also different in that it's a solid piece of plywood with veneer over it, whereas the silver spur tables have a curve across the face and they are hollow or semi-hollow inside. There's an article that I wrote on our blog uh, for the Modern Lady magazine, which goes over fairly thoroughly the silver spur tables and, and repairs that can be made to those. The other thing that a silver spur table would have, it would have a cross band, just like you see on the door, and they chose not to do that on the, on the uh, Corniche. These tables came in in atrocious condition. Uh, the still images that uh, will be available on our blog when this is posted will show what these tables look like in the the lifting and peeling of the veneer that was there. And even the substrate plywood had some issues that had to be repaired before we could go ahead with the cosmetics of putting on new veneer to match the interior. This is book matched inside. It's book matched with another figure on the outside. So we have the table and the table with the frame. This particular piece is also a common, is common to the mid 80s and later Corniches. Uh, Every set of wood that we've had from, that includes this piece, this piece has to be re-veneered. So it was re-veneered also, along with a short console piece. This is one, as I say, of maybe a half a dozen or eight Corniche sets, Bentley Continental sets that we've had in the last couple of months. And it's the only one with picnic tables, so it's a little bit unique.